Okay, so we left off, my battery went dead, and so I had to put a little charge on it. This is going to be the third video. Okay, this was the one I was talking about, or I was trying to, I was getting the support off. So you see there's some stringers where there was no support out on the width part, because the support material didn't quite meet the edges width-wise. And uh, you, you see this print had a lot, it had like inclusions and stuff. It, it was my first one, I think it was spitting out. See, even here, there's a bunch of inclusions. That's the top. This is the top. So it's some settings. You'll see the next print came out much better. So this print, it's kind of hard to use as an example. But here where that, you know, you, you can't pull this stuff off. It's all fused. It's fused um, to the actual part, the, the raft. So getting this off is almost impossible as far as having a raft there yeah it's like it's just like how the Kuro one is and uh, so we'll let that one go that's first second the, this the support material sure came off really nice there um, as far as that goes okay now this is the third one this is the one I did the manual support layers with in the print I I took I think the perimeters from three to two I think that was one setting I changed. I still got some blobs on the edges that I can, you know, adjust with settings. But overall, the part is much, much better. You see, this doesn't have all the inclusions on it, and just it came out a lot nicer than this one did. So let's start seeing how this goes. Um, those first two kind of came off. Pre oh yeah, they kind of peel off pretty nice. So let's see. I. Uh, I had a gap down the middle, so I'm sure there'll be stringers there. But yeah, this is popping away real nice. So you see where I had these gaps, and there, so there's you know filament sticking up there. I and that's just because I didn't have it. I had gaps there, so that's why I did that. That was my fault. Um, but uh, here you can, yeah, it's kind of the same as the Cura, where you basically you can get the edge off, but you can't do anything with. Uh, Let's see, I got two more pieces here. I'm going to try and pop out. There we go. There's one, and there's two. So you can basically see there where all the gaps are, and the filament is all stringy from not having support there. And then this stuff, you just you can't get it off. I don't know if there's a setting I can do to make this easier to get off, but it basically just becomes part of the part. Or you can try and sand it off I guess uh, I usually just get it as nice as I can kind of leave it um, overall like I said the part is definitely better than the first one I did where there's a lot more blobs you can see there's a lot less on this and I'm assuming from not having three perimeters to two and uh, I made a couple other little changes, not major changes, but little changes, and you can definitely see it's a lot better quality. But, you know, I still have blobs at the edges for some reason. I'm not quite sure why those are there. Um, on my the same printers, you know, both M2, you see I don't, with the Cure, I didn't have any of those blobs. So it's some setting. Um, this is Cura in my right, M2. A simplify 3D in my left um, M2 and you see the difference they both have that raft piece kind of fused to this part and uh, I had some stringers here on the on this one as well and this I have the kind of horizontal stringers from the support nut meeting but overall I mean most of this support came off pretty nice uh, it's this part when there's, I guess, you know, something to make it to where it doesn't fuse like that. I don't know exactly what can be done, but I mean, well, I do know, but I don't know how it's accomplished, I guess you'd say. Uh, but you can see, uh, oh, and let me bring the Affinia one back over just to compare. Here's the Affinia piece. Affinia on my right. This is my left with Simplify 3D. These are the finished parts. I'll just kind of you can see the bottom where it was. This is where it was. Support came off. Support came off, and you see how just really 
clean that is, and then I'll rotate them just kind of slowly where you can see. Actually, let me make it apples to apple. There we go. And I'm rotating them just kind of, you can see the differences. This is the most important is where that support is. Just see how clean that is. So I hope you're able to get something from this. I uh, say the word if there's like some other tests I can do that would help you. Uh, I'll try. I'll definitely take some pictures of these too. So hopefully you can see them up close. Okay, that's it for now, and uh, we will uh, uh, talk to you soon. Have a great one. Take care. Later.